Hello, this video is to show you how to add a kill counter to your map and to display it on the HUD so you can uh, actively see how many kills you have while playing. Uh, to do this, you need to add a player proxy. You need to set the player proxy to any player. Okay. And what we're going to do is uh, on player killed an AI, what we're going to do is we're going to change a variable integer okay uh, add a new integer um, and what we're going to be doing is we're going to be uh, oh, where is it here yep adding to that integer okay so our integer here we're going to call this uh, kills um, I'm just going to leave that how it is minimum value is zero um, don't want you to go in the negative, initial value 0, okay. It's all good. So whenever any player kills an AI, um, it's adding 1 to the kills variable. Now all we have to do is plug this into the HUD. Um, and so to do that, we're going to take our HUD settings. Um, right here, we're going to replace the right side of the HUD. Uh, which is the preset to team score. We're going to change that to a variable. Uh, the text that the player is going to see is kills. Okay, and the variable being displayed beside that text is the number of kills, which increases each time someone kills an AI. Um, and I'm going to change that color to red. Okay. Uh, play time is uh, what it is. Uh, I'm going to change that one to blue because the other two are green and red already. So just, I don't know, keep the format going there. Okay. So now every time someone kills a AI, uh, that the kill should go up. So let's test this out real quick see if it works okay we have the uh, cash at the top kills time being played is blue okay so I can hurt them I get the money for hurting them and I kills are increased when they die. There. There you go. Oh, that stuff that was floating there, that was just something I was uh, messing around with. Um, with a loot, a loot system, dropping loot. Um, I'll, I'll make a video about that. Uh, so yeah, kills increase, cash increases. Uh, the cash is from previous video. Um, my first video, actually. So if you already have uh, the system set up to give money when you kill an AI and to also... Uh, give money when an AI is hurt. You could actually just um, take this away. Oh, I'm just going to get rid of this. Uh, you don't actually have to make everything from scratch every time. You could take this player proxy, which is already being used. You don't actually need to make a, a second one like I already had. So I'm going to player kills an AI. It is going to increase the kills integer add yep uh -huh. there we go and it's going to add it by one um, and yeah it's, it's uh, the exact same thing as before just more neat it's everything uh, that involves killing AI I have in one section here so it's easy to find uh, how if something works uh, in the editor if you keep it organized which I recommend doing uh, if you're unorganized, you're going to kick yourself in the butt later. So, 
Let's go work. Let's go over here. Kills go up by one. There you go. So that's it for this video. Uh, stay tuned.